Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install OpenSUSE latest version on VMA workstation. Go to OpenSUSE official website that is get open sus.org. See here we have two types of distributions desktop and server. The process is same but in this video I am going to show you how to install OpenSUSE distribution on VMA workstation. Click on this desktop. Download this lib. This is for sysadmin enterprise developers regular desktop users. Okay. Click on download. See here the version making at the time of making this video is 15.5. Click on this download and its size is 4.1 gigabyte. See download has been started. Go to downloads. I am cancelling this download. In your case wait until download completes because I have already downloaded. Now open VMware workstation. If you want to install VMware workstation, then go to the link provided in the video description and install it. Start, then search for VMware workstation. Here, mine is VMware workstation player. It is free. See here the non-commercial use only. Okay. See, these are in the left menu, we have different virtual machines. Click on this create a new virtual machine then select the install disk image file that is ISO click on browse then select the downloaded open source ISO click on open then click on next here provide the name I am giving 1555 this is the location to store the virtual machine browse Enter, select the folder, select the folder and click on OK, click on Next. Here we have to provide the virtual hard disk size. I am giving 50 gigabytes, click on Next. See, this is the summary of virtual machine. If you want to change any one of these virtual machine settings, click on Customize Hardware. I am going to increase the memory size as 4 gigabytes. Then click on close. See memory size has been changed. Also see here the checkbox. Power on this virtual machine after creation. I don't want to power on. Uncheck this one. Click on finish. See this is the virtual machine. If you want to edit any one of the settings again. Click on this edit virtual machine settings. Or right click on it and select the settings. Both are same. Now click on this play virtual machine. Or select the virtual machine from the left menu and click on power on. Both are same. Use up and down arrows and select the installation.
default language is English. I am not going to change anything. Click keep all this as it is and click on next. Click on this activate online registration. See select the by default it has selected these repositories. If you want to select any one of them you have to check the check box. Otherwise uncheck it and click on next. Here we can select any one of system rules. I am going with desktop KDE Plasma. Okay, click select it and click on next. See, it is going to create these partitions. If you want to change, you have to click on guided setup. Just I am going with the defaults and click on next. Select the time zone. By default, it has selected Eastern New York. Suppose if you want to select India, you have to click on on India map in the in this world map or simply select here US then Eastern like this okay so click on next here we have to create new user I'm giving user full name as after scores and this will be the username and provide the password for this user and check this automatic login otherwise if you want to skip this user creation you have to check this radio button then click on next click on s see this is the installation summary click on install again it is asking confirmation click on install see installation has been started i am pausing this video until this installation completes see installation has been completed click on ok to restart Then click on boot from hard disk. Select the first option. Provide the password of the user. Click on close, click on application launcher, then click on console. See here it is terminal. Now more slash etc os hyphen release. See we have installed OpenSUSE and its version is 15.5. So in this video we have seen how to download and install OpenSUSE 15 on VMA Rostation Player. For more videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.